Hello students and welcome to week nine. So I wanted to walk you through the things that are going on this week in um, English 290. So we are more than halfway through the semester and I am working hard on catching up on all of the grading for you all. Um, so this coming week we are going to be doing our interview discussion sessions with technical communication practitioners. Um, and your next major assignment is assigned this week. So on our homepage of our Learn site, you'll see that I have a, a week nine item here. Actually, let me refresh. Um, so we have our week nine item here. And I have a list of several things that you have to do this week. The first and most important thing to set the tone for all of the work you have to do this week is reading chapter six. That is in the syllabus. I did have to rearrange the order of some items in the syllabus a couple weeks ago. So if you're printing up the course calendar rather, um, you're gonna wanna print up a new copy because I've just made two small changes of chapters that you're reading. Um, so we're now reading chapter six for this week. It's about conducting research. One of the strategies that they discuss for conducting research is interviewing. So in preparation for your interview this week with a technical communication practitioner, you're going to want to read all about it in your book. So the assignment that you're doing will also concern doing other kinds of research, online research, so the chapter also talks about that. So you're going to want to read the chapter. So then from Tuesday and Friday, um, you'll be doing your interviews, discussions with technical communication practitioners. I sent the sign-up sheet to everybody. It is linked here on your um, to-do list for week nine. You'll see it, it's a link here, but I have it pulled up. So um, here is the sign-up sheet. Each practitioner has a bio listed here, um, where it says bio. And there are dates for each. Tuesday, October 18th at one o'clock is John German. Three students have already signed up as of my recording of this video. Wednesday, October 19th at 10 o'clock um, with Antonia Cardella. Thursday at 1 o'clock, and that is with Faith Tinnen. And Friday at 1 o'clock, and that's with Simon Cordero. So I have students signed up for every one of these meetings so far, but this only represents like half of you. So half of you still need to sign up. So that you need to do and you need to attend your interview on the designated day. So before you do your interview, um, you're going to want to access the assignment, which is right here on the left sidebar, um, interview memo, final draft, turn in here. So this is where you're going to turn it in, but it's also where you read the assignment. When you go to turn it in, you're going to click on interview memorandum assignment. And you're just going to submit it. But um, here's the assignment. When I pasted it in, it came out looking really ugly. So I'm going to use a PDF version to show you the assignment right now. This is a two page assignment. It has a lot of detail in it. Um, so you're going to want to take some time to really read this assignment. You have to turn in a final PDF that has three different parts. It's got a two-page memo, it has an interview transcript, and it has a record of your notes, which I just mean not an audio recording, but a documentation of your notes that you took um, for, for your research, your online research. I give you five research questions that you have to ask the practitioner. So if you're in a group of five at your interview, um, each of you will probably ask one of these, and then you'll have an opportunity to ask your own questions. You will come up with um, three to five questions of your own that you will ask your practitioner after you ask the five that are common to all students. You will have to craft an interview transcript. Um, your book tells you how to do that on page 139. And you are also going to uh, complete a memorandum, a two-page memorandum. Um, I'm not going to read through everything that's on this PDF right now in this video because you can read it on your own. And I also give you a basic rubric of the grading for this assignment, but I will have a more discrete rubric that will um, subdivide each of these numerical categories into smaller numerical components. Um, and that'll be posted on Learn uh, closer to the time uh, when your draft is due. So um, anyway, back to week nine. So after your interview day, you're going to want to begin drafting your assignment and working on your secondary research because 
um, week 10, when we come back to class, that's this week, the first day we come back, Monday of that week, we have an in-class workshop where you need to come with a working draft of your project. And I'm going to go through the classroom and look at what everybody has done on that day. Um, I will be at all of the interviews in week nine, so if you need to see me, I'll be there for all of these. Um, again, they're Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. That's not really reflected here. It just says Monday, Wednesday, Friday because those are our class days, but the interviews are Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Um, you'll remember if you signed up for this one on Tuesday, you're actually going to the Satellite Coffee on University Avenue, and you'll meet me there and John German there. Um, and let's see whether there's anything else I wanted to tell you guys. Um, I don't think so. So just get ready for this next assignment. Read the assignment. Prepare for your interview. Prepare your questions. Prepare to be professional at the interview. And I'll look forward to um, seeing you all there. Um, the first group of you I'll see on Tuesday. Um, if you have any questions, let me know. And good luck.